Hello Royal fans, today's headline. Royal courtiers will reportedly be handling the topic of Prince William and Kate's popularity, very sensitively, claims a royal commentator. Despite Prince Charles being the heir to the throne, the 72-year-old prince is at a risk of being eclipsed by his eldest son and daughter-in-law, who are incredibly popular with the British public. Royal commentator Richard Eden said, I think it's a very tricky balancing act. I mean, we saw at the James Bond premiere, when we had William, Catherine, Camilla and Charles on the red carpet together. It did look a bit like Charles and Camilla were the supporting act for William and Catherine. When asked if this could be a source of irritation for Prince Charles, Richard Eden replied, I suspect it does. I mean, people always say that he was annoyed by the attention that Diana got. So it's very tricky if before he even becomes monarch, he's been eclipsed by his younger son. So I think it is sensitive, and I think even in Cardiff we've seen just Charles and Camilla, William and Catherine are not there too. Courtiers will have to handle this whole issue very sensitively, but as we've seen the Queen visibly aging with her walking stick, and then I think it is a problem. We've got a very old monarch and a very old heir to the throne. According to recent polls, Prince William and Kate are ranked as the third and fourth most popular royals, with an approval rating of over 60%. Prince Charles, meanwhile, is ranked as the sixth most popular royal. In recent months, Prince Charles has increased the number of joint engagements he attends with Her Majesty the Queen. Prince Charles and Camilla will join forces with the Cambridges in November when they travel with the Queen to Glasgow for the COP26 Climate Summit. The outing will mark the second time in recent weeks for the Cambridges to attend an engagement with Prince Charles and Camilla. The Royal Foursome appeared on the red carpet for the No Time to Die premiere at the Royal Albert Hall. There's today's Royal News. Thank you for watching. Goodbye for now.